Well, most of the reports we've heard are here in Tooele. Most people, they don't make, like, make much of it. They look at the package, they throw it away, they go about their day. But the state says that is not what you should do. They want to investigate. Check my mail, opened my mailbox, and I was like, oh, yay, I got some packages. This woman says she didn't remember ordering anything from China. I hope that um, it's nothing too serious. The label said earrings, but something else was inside. Well, obviously they're not jewelry. <laughs> And I opened them up and they were seeds. But why would there be mislabeled seeds in from packages. China in her mailbox? In she didn't think much of it at first. <laughs> then she found out this is something the State Department of Agriculture is investigating seriously. And she got some stern advice. Just don't throw them in the garbage, don't plant them, don't touch them. Plants and seeds in Utah are regulated strictly, which is why agents with Customs and Border Protection could also become involved in the investigation. And there was an article that I found from the UK saying that this has been happening over there and they are bad seeds, they are invasive. When she Nine posted about ago, it online, she just, found out was, one by one. Toilet. These three are from my daughter. Quite a few people had the same story and might have been so curious what the seeds were, they planted them to find out. I would say at least 40 people. I mean, there's even a possibility it could be a drug or something. The Better Business Bureau is planting a different idea. It's too early to say, but this could just be a scam where some companies will send you a product so they can post a fake review in your name. That is rather random. I don't think I've heard of seeds before. So the first thing to do is to Google your address and see what's out there. Hopefully that's all it is, but, but why? We just can't be too vigilant. We have to... There's too much crazy stuff going on in our world anymore, and a lot of it's coming from China. The next step is to take the seeds to a laboratory. From there, they will figure out what they are and what else needs to be done. Of course, people are concerned. They don't know what to think. The Department of Agriculture says, look, if this has happened to you, if this story sounds familiar, give them a call so they can come by and pick up your mail. We're live in Twilla, Adam Herbets, Fox 13 News, Utah.